Hello, dear friends of the library. My name is Susan Barrett Merrill, and I'm a fiber artist. Welcome to the studio. I am here today to talk about the exhibit that's coming up for the, the months October, November, and December in the glass cases of the Howard Room at the library. I am hoping that you will enjoy these masks that I've woven, and they are woven with um, flat island sheep wool and dyed with the plants from this summer. And every one of them is reading a book. And what I love about this sculpture, they're on an iron tree that was made by Joe Meltrader, who um, is my neighbor in Brooksville, Maine. And I have loved having this opportunity during this very difficult time that we're in to really think about the library and how wonderful it is to have a library like the Blue Hill Library in our community. Because I think without it, we wouldn't have the amazing resources that we have right now. Each one of the masks on the story tree is reading a book, telling a story, or playing a musical instrument. For example, here is a quartet playing first, second violins, and a viola, and a cello, and they are playing a Mozart quartet in C major. And you can see the quartet is right here. They have been reading the music and now they are playing together. And here is poetry reading going on. Here is someone eating breakfast and toast and reading a cookbook to see what she will cook for the day. Here is Ashley Bryan telling his story about flying blackbirds. And here is a dad reading to his baby. Have you seen my wooden spoon by Abram Barrett? And here is his daughter listening. Here is a person who is reading Michelle Obama's book, Becoming. And here is a person who is reading an inconvenient truth about climate change. So you can see that all of these masks have library books. 